With our constantly deteriorating road infrastructure here in SA, most car buyers are shifting towards buckies and compact SUVs. So today we are looking at the Cherry Tigo 4 Pro, the new compact SUV which is about to turn the Mzansi car market upside down. This car right here is a true game changer in its class. Before we get on to this review, I would like to share my golden advice when it comes to car buying, which is do your own research. Forget about all the noise and stereotypes around you, especially with social media, because social media people are not real people. They are in most cases faceless individuals behind fake accounts. Just do your own research and be open-minded. So in this video, we'll take a look at all the cool features you get with this dynamite and then do a quick test drive. And I heard from STR, it says that it has like a million kilometers engine warranty or yes, something like 10 years, correct. a million yes. for the so first buyer. Yeah, for the first buyer. So for the first buyer, when you buy the vehicle brand new, mm. you get a um, 10 year or 1 million mm. kilometer mm. engine warranty. Um, but that's for the first, first owner. Yeah, okay. it told me, it yes. told me. Firstly, I would like to send a shout out to the entire team of Cherry Bombella for the great reception I got when I visited the dealership. From the sales team to management, Leo, Estienne, Denzel, and just everyone. They shared all the information I needed and made this review possible. So if you are in or around Nelspreit and you are on the market for a compact SUV, check out Cherry Bombella. The dealership is in Nelspreit Riverside Park, just opposite Land Rover. Their details will be linked in the description and comment section. Welcome to another video. In front, you get halogen headlamps on the base models and LED headlamps are only available in the Elite CVT and the Rage Topping Elite SE. With this car, there's no optional extras. Whatever comes with the car is all you get. At the center, we have a hexagonal front grille and a red decorative trim on the chin. All the models come with LED daytime running lights and for me, the front end is really impressive. In terms of colors, the Tigo 4 Pro is available in white, blue, gray, black, red and silver. This car is available in five variants, which are the Urban, Comfort, Elite Manual, Elite CVT, and the top of the range Elite SE. Out of the five, only two have manual transmissions and the rest are automatic. On the side, we have some nice blacked out alloy wheels, which are 17 inch in the Elite models and 16 inch in the two lower end models. Moving on to the rear end, there's a roof spoiler with an integrated stop light, some nice tail lamps, reflectors and chrome exhaust cutouts. In the boot, there's a spare wheel and the boot size is not too bad for a compact SUV. Overall, the rear end is well designed and so far I can't find anything I don't like with this car. Inside, we have a multifunction steering wheel, a digital instrument cluster and regardless of which model you go for, you get a 10-inch multimedia touchscreen which supports Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. Leather seats are only available in the Elite models and only the driver's seat is power adjustable. This car features an electronic parking brake with auto hold. With the Elite models, you also get a power sunroof which is not available in the two lower end models. At the back, there's some air vents and one USB port. The legroom is okay for a budget SUV. This interior has quite a lot of impressive features and considering the price of this car, I can give it a 9 out of 10. Before we get on to the test drive, let me quickly show you some of the cool features you get with this car. The first one is that you can start the engine from outside with the key. This feature is going to be very useful when you are chilling with your boys and your wife sends you an SMS that it's time to come home. So you'll just start the car and give your boys a cue that it's time to bounce. Hashtag how to tell your boys it's time to bounce without actually telling them. Just press the button. The second feature is the voice control function. Turn off the aircon. Got it. Turning off AC. So with this car, you can use voice commands for opening windows, 
opening the sunroof and playing music. Last but not least, we have this storage compartment which you can use to store beverages. And when you switch on the knob, it allows cold air to come in from the aircon in order to keep your drinks cool. But don't get funny ideas and put savannas and Jaeger bombs in there. Now let's get on to the moment we've all been waiting for. The test drive. Let's get used to this trash. It's so soft. Yeah, it's very soft. <laughs> yeah, compared to my like the bite is on the floor. You don't even need to like lift it that much. Under the hood, the Eben and Comfort models have a 1.5 naturally aspirated engine with a power output of 83 kilowatts and 138 Nm of torque. The Elite models, on the other hand, have a 1.5 liter turbocharged engine with 108 kilowatts of power and 210 Nm of torque. The Tigo 4 Pro has quite a long list of great features, and if I were to mention each and every one of them, this video will be longer than an episode of Game of Thrones. So if you wanna know more about this car, check out the Cherry website. One thing I've noted that requires attention is the voice command system, cause it has a bit of a malfunction. Sometimes when you say 
open windows the logo will say okay opening windows but the windows won't actually open but that's not a deal breaker because even market leading brands do have such glitches and they can easily be fixed with just a software update and some programming so in conclusion this car looks nice it drives well it has great features it is comfortable and affordable so i don't see a reason why you shouldn't buy it in terms of pricing it starts from only 269,900 for the base model all the way to 359,900 for the top of the range elite se share your thoughts on this car in the comment section thank you for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel for more car content in a Mzansi context.